What's going on? This is Alan Brown, aka Bully the Kid, and this video is uh, showing what you can do with the $75 bass. So I have two, basically two of the same bass, just uh, different colors of it. And one bass I did modifications to, aesthetic, and as well as added a pickup. And the other one I left pretty much stock except I changed the uh, pickup covers. So the basses I'm talking about are um, these. Glary bass here, P bass, as well as another P bass here. Both blue. One has a uh, blue burst with gold hardware and stuff and the other one is the classic chrome. Classic chrome and then this one here is gold hardware. Uh, but they are the same base, same materials made, same thickness of the neck, same fingerboard. Um, only difference is this one. This one here has a Seymour Duncan pickup and this one has the stock pickup but the pickup cover is changed. Both dope bases, they both look good. Uh, but this is what you can do with a $75 base. So I'm going to play one of them and uh, I'll play some styles with this one and then I'll play this one and then you can try to you know gauge whether or not it was worth me doing all that stuff to it. So let's start with the stock bass so you can hear how that sounds and um, yeah let's uh, let's do that and I'm doing this DI so give me a second stock base stock form only thing I did halfway through was kind of uh, raise my signal so they could hear it a little bit better but uh, that is the stock base this is the modified base everything else is still the same only thing that's changed are the strings I have black beauties on here and um, the preamp the uh, not the preamp the pickup so let's give a listen to what that actually sounds like
stuff. Let's do some slap stuff. <laughs> swap out the pickup so literally night and day from what as far as the gain the expression all the random stuff like that um, the hum that you heard in it I do have to work on the grounding issues but that is my fault about me swapping stuff around so that is the hum that's in it uh, this is gonna be amplified because we're doing a DI if you hear it through a speaker you wouldn't be able to hear that hum. But because this is DI, then it is there. So apologies for that, but you have an idea. The pickups can do a world of difference. And this is $75, the pickups only cost like 65 bucks. So for the price of, you know, under $200, a very giggable bass. Keep in mind, out of the box, this Glary bass is ready to go. Let's do a setup running it's pretty much it's pretty amazing and I have three now I have these two P's and I have a J bass lurking somewhere around here we go I have a J bass lurking here so if y'all like these sounds as far as stock sounds go and check out Glary Inc or GlaryGuitars.com uh, Glary Inc or you can just follow the link that I'll put in the description below and uh, go back and check out the other videos I had when I did the unboxing and all that good stuff like, subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. If you do subscribe, hit the bell. Thank y'all for rocking with me. Thank y'all for watching. If you watched thus far, till next time, this is Alan Brown, aka Bullet the Kid. Y'all be easy.